Hey guys, what's up? So we have another NBA pick video for you today. As always, we have another two picks in this video, and I'm getting it out a little bit late, but I'm trying to get it out before the night games. I have two picks that I really like in this video, so I'm going to get into them in a second. But first, I want to go over the fact that our last video for College Basketball Saturday, unfortunately, the two plays I put in that video did end up missing. Before that, we were on a 7-0 and run, so a lot of people saw that last video, saw that we were on a 7-0 and run, and then wanted to try to hop on um, hop on that run with us and unfortunately both the plays missed so a lot of people were upset about that and again i'm sorry guys but i want you guys to realize that obviously i'm upset too you know what i mean like i put my own time and effort and money on these plays and you know unfortunately that's how sports betting goes we're not going to hit every single play no one hits every single play you know if you guys are super upset about it and you think there's someone out there that can hit a hundred percent of the time um go try to find them go watch their videos you know, I'm not forcing you to watch these videos. If you think that I'm horrible at betting, please, by all means, leave and go watch our videos. No one goes 100%. It's impossible. So to just come on the video, I saw a lot of people comment on the video saying like, I dropped a, like, this is my first time watching videos and I dropped a bag on this play and it missed. Like, you suck. It's like, guys, I'm not telling you to drop your, you know, drop your car payments on the play. It's just a free YouTube video like pick video. You know what I mean? I'm just giving you guys two picks that I like in the video. Even though we're on a seven and zero run and we're doing good at some point, we're going to miss, you know what I mean? And then also in that video, I tried to say, guys, if you want free picks, if you want all my free picks, go to my winnable. It's in the link in the description of every video I post, go to the free picks. And then you could, you know, use those picks as well. I gave two, two man picks on prize picks, the one in the video, and then another free pick on the winnable. And this was the other free pick in the winnable. So the people that actually listened to me and went to the free picks on my website and then put in that play, they actually ended up hitting one of the one of the plays. So just I just want to reiterate, guys, do not come on the videos and then watch it, put a drop a bag on every or just one video and then be like, oh, you're the worst when we're still hitting our free plays. If you want my free plays, go sign up for the free plays. It's always linked in the description. Anyway, guys. Um, again, I'm sorry about missing the plays, but let's get on with the video. So we have this play right here. This was the free play that hit. This was another free play that hit on chalkboard. And then we hit a VIP play right here as well. So Saturday, obviously, it wasn't a great day, but it was, you know, pretty decent. Um, it was all right. We still hit a couple couple two mans there. So let's get into um, the video. So in one set, I just want to show you guys one thing real quick. The this is the winnable that I was talking about. If you want my free plays, these are all my free plays. And then you could also go over to the VIP picks, which I just posted the VIP picks for today, and I absolutely love them. Um, I'm hoping to cash out at least 15 units today. Like I think it really could be a huge day. And like I said, it'll be at the bottom of the screen. But if you use code March, you get 50% off of the VIP plays until the end of this weekend. So this is the last day to use code March, and then you get 50% off of the VIP plays. Um, if you do the month subscription, you'll get all the way through March Madness. So you'll get all of um, College Basketball and NBA up to that point, and then you'll get March Madness as well. So go sign up for that in the description. So first play, guys, we have Clint Capella. So he's playing the Mat the Orlando Magic, um, and he was on restricted minutes last game we bet on him last game actually he had um seven rebounds so he was on restricted minutes his line last game was at eight and a half rebounds he ended up having seven rebounds and this game he is fully healthy he's not supposed to be on any um, minutes restriction or anything like that as you can see he's been killing this line this whole season the only reason it's this low is because he just got seven last game and I was hoping after last game, I knew he was on a minutes restriction, and I was hoping that after that game, since he had a bad game, they would drop his lines, which they did. So I was expecting this to happen, so it's perfect. Um, but like I said, no minutes restriction in this game. He's been killing this line all year, so these lines are too low just because of the fact that he had a bad game last game. But it was a minutes restriction. He should be all good to go tonight. The only thing I would worry about, we're actually going to go with um, eight and a half rebounds and assists here. We're going to go over his rebounds set at eight rebounds and assists set at eight and a half. So he usually gets at least an assist a game. So it's just good value to take the one with the assists added to it. It's just 
helping us out at that point. Why would you not take that when it's only 0.5 more? So we're going to go take um, over on eight and a half rebounds and assists for him. But yeah, like I was saying, killing this all year. And the only thing I would worry about is a possible blowout. Um, but the spread right now is at minus one last time I checked. So even though I'm, you know, it might be a blowout right now, the spreads at minus like one and a half. So they're not expecting it to be a blow. As long as it's not a block, he should kill this line. He should clear this line. And honestly, I think he should get it done, honestly, in the first half. But even if he doesn't, third quarter, late third quarter, I can see it for sure. So eight and a half rebounds and assists for Capella. I, I really, really like that play. And then the next one is going to be Wemby over on four and a half blocks and steals. So it's right here. So... Three out of the last five games, the back-to-back -back games with 10 blocks and steals. That's just insane. He's playing Utah. So Utah's last three games, they've actually allowed to the opposing team center, they've allowed at least two blocks in three games straight, including Draymond, by the way. So Draymond Green got two blocks. Obviously, he's a great defender. Everyone knows that. But the guy's like, what, 6'8 or something? Wemby should get at least three blocks in this game, at least. And then every game he gets about two, three steals. So I really, really like this line. I think it's way too low for him right now. He's on a hot streak with the blocks and steals. He's been going off, and especially against Utah, I think that's a good, good matchup for him to get a lot of blocks tonight. Um, so I just really, really like that line for Wemby right there. So this is the play, guys. Eight and a half rebounds and assists, and then four and a half blocks and steals. Again, I'm sorry I'm getting this video out a little bit late, um, but these are for the later games, so you guys still have time to lock this play in if you want to do that. And then we have other free plays coming out later today. I have another video dropping tonight for tomorrow's games, so make sure to watch that video because I'm getting it out early, so you'll definitely have time to lock those plays in. Um, if you guys like these videos, go ahead, like it. helps me out a lot, and then... Just subscribe if you guys want to see more of these videos. I post a video every single day for NBA and college basketball as long as there are enough games to post a video about. And other than that, guys, that's the play. Good luck with all your picks, and I'll catch you in the next video.